Tennessee still can't find consistency, and it won't be easy to get back on track this week as they get a Denver team that finally tasted victory. Predictions for you in a sec, but first, the numbers to know. If this game is another battle of defenses, at least the Titans know they'll be there at the end. Allen goes through his reads, spins away from trouble, takes his shot, and that pass is picked! Tennessee picked off Josh Allen once, held him to 219 yards passing, and sacked him four times. On the year, the Titans' pasty is holding opposing QBs to an under 90 passer rating, and they're top five in sacks. The rush D hasn't been quite as good though, allowing close to four and a half yards of carry, which plays into Denver's hands, or more specifically, into Philip Lindsay's hands. <laughs> Second and goal, and Lindsay's in for the touchdown. Lindsay just hit the Chargers for 114 rushing yards on 7.6 yards a carry, and Royce Freeman ran for 4.7 yards a carry on his 13 runs. So the Broncos' ground game is warm for this matchup, and so is their defense. Rivers back pedals to the 12, end zone bound, and he's intercepted! The Broncos dominated Phillip Rivers and company in every facet holding Rivers to no touchdowns and picking him twice, and erasing Melvin Gordon in his return to action. That performance does not match how they've fared in their first four games, though. They still have given up 4.6 yards per carry on the year, which ranks near the bottom of the league. Does that mean a big day for Derrick Henry? Third and goal. Henry lunges. Touchdown. Henry rushed for 78 yards and a score last week, and that was against the Bills, so maybe the Titans' O runs through Henry this week, since Denver's front seven isn't quite as stout against the run as Buffalo's is. Okay, enough with the numbers. How about we see who our NFL media panel likes to prevail in this one? Lasu on that last tackle, loss of two. Blacko now down the field again, wide open target. There he is, Tony. Sutton breaks the tackle, and he's gonna take it to the end zone for the touchdown. 